What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Fallout 76 video. In this one, as you can see in the top right, we're actually going to do the mission that we got in the previous video. We got attacked by some uh, some Mr. Gutsies who were actually, you know, uh, prison wardens or, or prison guards, uh, essentially, for a prison up in the Toxic Valley. So... Uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do that because if I remember correctly, if I log out, I will lose the mission until I get attacked again by those robots. So I'm gonna take advantage of doing that as well. And while we're at it, we're also gonna go and head over to Harper's Ferry because we have a miscellaneous mess, uh, uh, quest to investigate Harper's Ferry. And at that point, we'll make the decision on whether or not, depending on time, whether or not we can potentially squeeze in another mission or calling it a video there. So... If you're excited for this video, do me a huge favor, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel as well if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, let's get on over there. Alright, so the good thing about Falsely Accused is that this is also a good way to get a, a legendary weapon as well. It's not a very good one to be honest, but it's uh, it's it's called... Well, I'll, I'll, I'll show you when we get it, but for now, I need to... Let's go ahead and put this away. I'll keep the Blade of Bastet. Uh, put the that away let me see if i can if i even have the crafting materials to upgrade the blade of bastet yet i really don't think i do oh wait, i have to craft it don't i um edged blade of bastet no I, I mean i have everything i just need four copper well let's see if my scrap machine gives me four copper Uh, doesn't look like it. Hold on, let me see. Copper. I don't have any copper, I don't think. I don't know where I got all that flux, but okay, sure, why not? Alright, so let's go ahead and hop on over. Looks like I don't have anything close there, so I'll go to the train station and pretty much just go north from there. This one, this mission, if I remember, I don't really remember it, man. I just know you do get a legendary weapon out of it. So it's pretty cool. But honestly, um, I don't think it's a very long mission. So this one and mixed in with that Harper's Ferry one, I think is going to make for two quick missions here for the channel. So, I mean, obviously, I don't know. We'll find out when we cross that hurdle. So, yeah. All right, so north. We got to go find the prison. You know what I should be doing is going through the train stations and see if we can find a serrated mod for this weapon. Because it is pretty strong, but I like the bleeding effect. I don't know why. But on top of that though, like... I still wish I had a vampire swing speed instead of a vampire's uh, power attack. You know what I mean? Hey, you. Where are you going? Hey, you. Where are you going? Hey, you. Where are you going? <laughs> Alright, let's go. I don't really like this prison, dude. It, it, it can get confusing sometimes, even with the map markers present. But at least we got a good idea of what kind of enemies are here. And I can already hear them creeping around. Hello. Ah, stuck. Where'd you come from? Alright, um... No, that's to leave... Alright, we have to go upstairs. We have to talk to the warden. You were attacked. My marshal thought you were an escaped prisoner. An underling will pay for this. <laughs> Please don't tell the press. The governor would slash my budget. It may be fortunate you came here. Fortunate for me, that is. This place is in such a state of disrepair that inmates are running loose in the halls. 
I need someone to manually authorize turret activation at each of the four security stations. Nothing says stay in your cell like an active turret. Will do, sir. It's kind of funny because I actually did corrections for a while too. Um, nope, I'm not trying to escape that way. Alright, yeah, it's this way. Hi. We gotta find some turrets. So that we can activate them. Oh god, I can hear them already. <sighs> Die! Hey, get away from me. Oh my god, there's so many of them. If I wasn't so strong, dude, I, this would, could be hard. And I'm kind of happy that they're all, they're all literally trying to find me. Awesome. Uh, guard terminal, no, right here. Luckily, we have the prison password. Authorized turret activation. Alright, that's one. Alright, looks like there's one on this side. Ah! Oh no! Dude, alright. Um. Oh my god, dude. They're literally everywhere. Can I get in here? No. Wait a minute, I have to get in there. I have to find a key, don't I? <laughs> Goodbye. Yeah, because I have to get in there and use that thing. Where's the freaking turret? I mean, the uh, key, though. Oh, here comes the Pharrell ghouls. Watch it be on one of the freaking ghouls that I had already killed. That would suck. All right, looks like this is the back entrance for the food employees. Let's go ahead and look around. This is an exit. Okay. Where'd you guys come from? I can still hear more. Okay, I see you. All right. Come on, man. I need to find a key. But where this key is... Hey, how'd you get up here? Huh. Alright, what is that? Authorize D? Get away from me. Alright, let's, let's go and try to do this other one. Huh. Actually, you know what I you know what I could do? Let's go back there. I got an idea. I probably do need a key, but I can actually do this faster by doing this. Check this out. All right. Uh perception. Oh crap. I passed it. There we go. I need expert po uh, pick lock. All right. Oh, I only have one perception. Well, that's a problem. <laughs> um, what can I do? Uh, I need 15 strength and 15 endurance. That much is for sure. I want that for damage. You know what? I could... I don't need agility, really. So let's go ahead and just move one point from agility to perception. And who knows? 
Honestly, I might. Wait a minute. There we go. I might, I might end up moving it back, to be honest. Oh god. Right there. Perfect. I can hear all the freaking feral ghouls just running around. Alright, activate turret. Activation. Alright, and while we're here, let's turn on the guards. Powering up. Protectron on. Hell yeah. Now, now, now we have turrets, protect and, and guards. Serve. All right, so now we gotta find. We need to find C and D. But realistically, I think they're in another portion of the facility in general. That'll be funny if I find the key like right now. All right, yeah, A and B are here. Yeah, D is over there. So we do, we have to go around. So let's go around. Appalachia, sure, why not? It's, we have to go into a separate portion. I think there might be a way to hack and get here or maybe go around a specific way, but I don't know. I, I think there's a, a different way that we can do this. Cause I know there's like this place where there's like a like the prison yard, where the inmates work out and you know play basketball and all that random stuff that inmates do, and stab each other. <laughs> um, but it's in it's it's around the side. So let's go ahead, get out of my way, you troop. <laughs> Goodbye. Can you imagine how much damage I would do if I actually had a super strong weapon? But realistically, I, I I like this weapon. Hey, why you gotta shoot me for? Hey, I killed you. Oh, I accidentally grabbed 308. Geronimo! All right, let's retreat. Thank you. I like the fact that all these guys have caps. I wasn't expecting that to work, but it did. So yay me. Alright, this is the way that I know of. Solitary confinement, baby. This is for all the troublemakers. But little do they know, I can do more trouble than they can. And make it. Because I make trouble. Because I'm a trouble maker. You know, I'm not going to lie to you. I have no idea what the hell that just, what that was. Alright. Hi. Um, okay. Authorized turret control. Alright. Ah! I'll oh, see. This is the prison penitentiary key. Alright, there you are. But I knew I saw you somewhere around here. Oh, there was two of them. Alright. Looks like we just need to get to D. Solitary and then C. Is this even the right way? I mean, I guess there's one way to find out, right? Excuse me, coming through. Oh, there it is. Woo! Alright, let's take care of these zombies first. Ow. There you are. Alright, that should be the last one. Actually, no, I think I hear another one. But let's go ahead and turn this on really quick. I think that's the last one. We should complete it in theory. Right? 
deliver authorization codes to the warden. All right. So I don't think there... I think I have to go back out the same way I came in. All right. I don't even know where I'm at right now. I'm lost. Help! <laughs> like, I'm legitimately lost. Is this the entrance? I don't know. Let's go. Oh, it's the prison yard. So we got to go all the way around. That's my main character. I recently took that picture. As you can see, I'm very proud to be a Pioneer Scouts. I've done all the missions except... I think I said it in one of my previous videos. But I've done all the Pioneer Scouts except for one. But that's only because it doesn't give me like the... I, I think it's called like Electrician or something like that for the Apostle Scouts. It won't let me read... All right, it won't read... Uh, excuse me. It won't register um, the fact that I complete powering up. And that's literally the last thing I need. And then I would complete all the possum scout things or whatever. But like I said, it just it won't it won't register for me, so it's not really doing anything. I can't complete it. But I'm very I take pride in the fact that I've uh, I've done all of them that I can that are not bugged. You know what I mean? All right, let's go in here. And talk to Mr. Warden himself. Any minute now. <laughs> yeah, this is the last part too. I think once we talk to him, we complete this mission. It's a pretty short one, like I said. Alright, let's go up the stairs. And hello. Oh, you have him. Much obliged. <laughs> Now that those turrets can be activated, it should help ameliorate the chaos in the corridors. <laughs> Even Mad Dog Malone, our most notorious inmate, will think twice before venturing out of his cage. Yay! Pleasure working with you, sir. But... Yeah, this, that's how you get the civil unrest. It's just all right. Where's that? Right there. It's just all right. It's just a, it's just a shotgun, a pump action with 10 more action points. So, I mean, there's that. <laughs> all right. So now we got to go to Harper's Ferry. It's pretty far. But I think this is another short one. Who knows? We'll find out once we get to it, right? Harper's Ferry, if you haven't done so, is a pretty good place to nuke. Especially if there's feral ghouls at Harper's Ferry. Because I think, I think feral ghouls can spawn there or even uh, super mutants i don't remember ever seeing scorch there but i'm not gonna say they don't spawn there but i just personally never seen scorch there that i remember all right let's go no i don't want to do dropped connection i got mad hops So yeah, that was just a uh, modus trying to tell me that I should help him out. <laughs> Die, you! These are your use no longer. Ha! <laughs> ha! Is that it? All right, let's go ahead and check this out. All right, missing persons. Uh, missing hunting party. Oh, that was that was quick. <laughs> Alright, Duncan McCain's hunting party is officially missing. Their last communication stated they were heading north from Valley Galleria, tracking a pack of ghouls. Uh, the area should be avoided until the proper search party can be formed. If you can volunteer, please contact Eddie Haynes or Hayes. 
Missing members are all of them. Tracking. Rivers? I don't think any of this has to do with the mission, but I'm going to look it up anyways. Uh, Esme Rivers uh, has been missing for two days now. If anyone has any idea of her whereabouts or has any information whatsoever, please let Eddie Hayes know ASAP. Tess and Frank Hopner. Hey everyone, Sid here. My grandparents have gone missing. Why is everyone missing? Uh, we just woke up and they were gone without a trace. I think my grandma's wearing uh, her old blue dress and grandma and my grandma's my grandpa's in the same old suit. He never took my grandpa's in the same su suit. He never took off. Uh, far as I know, they ain't got no guns or any way to defend themselves. If anyone's willing to help me look, please let me or Eddie know before the end of the day. Vegas. I don't know if this is the right forum for this, but if people can uh, keep an eye out for my dog Vegas, my sister and I'd greatly appreciate it. He's a black and white border collie, super friendly. Even if someone finds him, just let us know uh, no, he's passed on. We'd be grateful. All right. Patrol schedules. Okay, so forum. Oh, really, Clay? Duncan's hunting party. Uh, are you guys saying uh, our best shots with a gun are out there missing? If they can't survive out in the damn swamp, how the hell are we supposed to make it without them? I hope to heaven and back that we ain't drafting a search party. Because I sure as hell won't be on it. Terry Lee replied. Not to mention the loss of hardball. Hardball? Who's hardball? Losing a Mr. Well, that answers the question. Losing a Mr. Gutsy ain't no small potatoes. Hoping they aren't uh, really lost. Just dicking it out for a safe moment to strike home. Uh, Becca Mason replied, Thanks for making us all feel warm and fuzzy inside, Qua Quaid. Also, good to know you'd never have my back if, I w if it was my ass out there. Kiad Shelton replied, Abso fucking lootly. <laughs> a robot like that is better off protecting us folks here at Harper's Ferry. Not running around in the damn swamp. Broken radio. Hey, y'all, my radio's gone but uh gone bust and I was hoping someone could either fix or replace her. It wouldn't just be for me but for my gramps only real form of entertainment. These days, on account of him being blind, I don't have much for trade. Maybe just a couple of packs of gum drops or a working light bulb or two. Abigail Singe something replied. Uh, Delia, I can fix that for you. No problem. How's about I pick it up around lunchtime tomorrow and don't worry about payments. I, can ima I can't imagine it. it'll take much to bring her back. Delia Webb replied, Thanks, Abby. Hey, it's Abby. Uh, I'd have her all ready for you. Cool. And that's it. So now we started tracking unknowns. Alright, so investigate the area north of Valley Gall Galleria. Have I discovered Valley Gall Galleria? Yeah, but I mean, I could just run there. East, right? Alright. Oh, well, maybe I can just run there. What would be the best way to get over there? That way. And then go east after that because there's a freaking huge-ass mountain kind of sort of in the way. Make it a little difficult for us to get through, right? I should probably eat. Do I even have food on me? Let's see here. Aid. I mean, I got some beer, but I don't want no beer. Okay, let's go ahead and drink some boiled water. Actually, I picked up some 
There we go. Thank God for for uh, cannibal, right? Or not cannibal. Uh, uh carnivore <laughs> cannibal. Here, you know what? I have some canned coffee too. Let's go. I should be able to just run for days now. Well, at least until that's done. I don't care if we leave the event, mainly because I wasn't gonna, I wasn't planning on doing it anyways. All right, let's go. You know the mire looks pretty nice, man. Pretty swampy and I don't know. It's actually pretty cool. Oh look, there goes the uh, the creepy place. By the way, all the way up here, Tanagra Town, I believe it's called is one of two places that you can find uh, royal jelly. It's in a bathtub within the very, very top. There's like a, a dilapidated house. And in a bathtub way up there, it can potentially spawn. Just, just so you guys know. It's one of two places. The other one is... Um, it's like this campground place. I can't remember what it's called, but... Alright, so we're here. What are we looking for? I don't know. Hello? Anybody here? Anything? Anyone? <laughs> Hmm. Oh, oh, it's hardball. Checking for vitals. So low they're undetectable. You there, civilian, identify. I've got a mission that would benefit us both. Hmm. Initial readings indicate non-hostile. As a member of the Free States and protector of Harper's Ferry, I hereby conscript you into service. Yes, sir. I'm wounded to protect. And re-establishing communications with Duncan McCann is vital. I have reason to believe their party was ambushed and a distress beacon deployed. But the signal is too weak to find. Your duty is to find a signal booster. Possible search locations include Harper's Ferry or the Valley Galleria Electronic Store. Once you've acquired the booster, proceed to the Survival Training Center and call down a cargo bot using this passcode. Attach the booster, release the cargo bot, and wait for the distress signal ping to reach your pit boy. Follow the ping, find the party. Dismissed! Yes, sir! Alright, let's read this Hello, note real quick. Serving. Nothing new to report. Dear finder of this note, if you have found this, obviously I'm dead. <laughs> no shit. Uh, but my two cats are not. If you have any heart, please seek out Harper's Ferry and resume care over my precious Lulla and Misty. Or notify Don't someone who will. Suggestions for checking. responsible parties, Nydra or Abby, Cigna, whatever, hey, all those people. Uh, people to stay away from at all costs. Charlie Walker. <laughs> Warning, if Misty bites you, it's a sign of love. Uh, sure, why not? So now we gotta go to... Harper's Ferry or Valley Galleria. Let's go to Valley Galleria first since it's probably a little closer. And find out what the situation is here. We have to find a signal booster because somebody is missing. Whoa, got a little bit of a texture issue there. Let's see if I live. <laughs> There's my answer. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and just respawn at the Valley Galleria. Fuck it. But that was funny. <coughs> Excuse me. I really wasn't I really wasn't expecting to die, but I think that's what makes it funny. Oh well. Alright, well, just like that. Magic is struck, and we are now at the Galleria. Scorched love to spawn here, by the way. I don't see any. Oh, there's one right here. I think I hear one over here. Yep. Hey, you! 
Goodbye. How is my... This weapon is really durable, dude. I've used it since I became level 50 and, I mean, still doing pretty good as far as durability goes. I am not complaining whatsoever. Any day now, Fallout. Jazzy music. Yeah, the last time we were here, I believe we took a picture of that it thing up there for hurts. for the camera. Alright, is there a signal booster in here? Yeah, I don't care if you guys find me. Come on. We'll go toe-to-toe -to -toe if you guys want. Found the signal booster. Alright, what's the mission now? Summon a cargo bot. How the hell am I supposed to do that? Is that over there? Yeah, I thought so. Alright, let's go kill this guy real quick. Go into sneak. And fast travel? Yay, it worked! Sometimes if there's an enemy too close, it just won't fast travel, I noticed. Like, I know it does the countdown thing most of the time, but sometimes it'll... I, I'm guessing it's a bug. Uh, but in my specific ex experience with the game, sometimes if there's like an enemy too close to you, it'll just, it'll start the countdown and then like a second later, it'll just stop. Almost as if you push the escape button, but I don't know. It's pretty annoying. And the fix to that is just walking away from said enemy. All right, we got to fight our way through. The last time we were here was actually to, uh... Go through the whole Brotherhood quest line. Which is probably my favorite faction in the game, to be honest. Oh, hello. Downstairs of this building is where you turn in technical data. And potentially get some cool Brotherhood of Steel stuff. Where are you at? I hear you. Oh, you're upstairs. You're so cute. Let's go ahead and kill everybody so they don't bother us while we're trying to summon a cargo bot. Why did they go downstairs? I swear, you Freddies are ridiculously crazy. See a plan? Radium rifle. Alright, don't mind if I do. Is that everybody? I guess so. Alright. Hello? Cargo drop. Request confirmation. Receive cargo bot en route to current location. Please stand by. Uh, alright. I hear somebody. Oh, he's way over there. What is he shooting at? Alright, let me, let me take this dude out. Stop shooting at me. Yeah, I have no idea what he was shooting at. Oh, there he is. Attach signal booster. Alright, now I gotta get into my radio? Potentially? Oh, there it is. Uh, distress beacon. Alright, which way do I have to go? This way? Hold on. Is there... Oh, God. You know what? I think it's going to stay within the mire. So let's just start going north and hopefully we find a signal. Because I don't know where this is at. Oh, yeah, it's going up. Now it's point ninety five, three point six five. It's actually going up pretty quickly. What the hell was that? I don't know. Whatever it was is gone now. Sixteen. I wonder where it's taking us. Oh. 
All right, let's just fast travel here. It'll be faster than running all that long distance. And we'll be in the circle. So I wonder, I don't, I don't, I legitimately don't remember this quest at all. I know I've done it. But I don't remember it. Oh god, we got a death claw over there. And a dead Brahmin. Two of them. So, okay. 89. 90. 90. Looks like we're going in the right direction. 94. 97. Is it here? Oh, there's a body right here. Oh, I found the distress beacon. There goes Randy Calloway. All right, let's see. Hey, Ella. It's Randy here. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm done for on account of my... My leg being blown off. I wanted you to know. You were right. We tracked them ghouls to Haven and... Christ almighty, they were talking and, and, and hollering sure as you and me. I mean... We all heard them stories about talking ghouls. I just never thought I'd bear witness to them. And I ain't the only one. Kendall knew it sure as I did. Oh god, I hate it when it does that. What's the... Randy's hall tape. Go ahead hey, and play. Ella, it's Randy here. I'm I'm pretty sure I'm done for on account of my my leg being blown off. I wanted you to know you were right. We tracked them ghouls to Haven, and Christ Almighty, they were talking and and, and hollering sure as you and me. I mean, we all heard them stories about talking ghouls. I just never thought I'd bear witness to them, and I ain't the only one. Kendall knew it, sure as I did. But Duncan, Duncan, he, he wouldn't let up. He didn't care they were begging to be left alone, but I did. If them creatures still got the mind God gave them, then who are we to take that away? Damn, that's crazy. They, I guess that was humans' first interaction with feral, with well, not feral ghouls, just ghouls in general. Let's see Nari's hall tape. Lucy just told us she thinks she found the perfect hideout in some sewers under Dyer Chem. Yep, you heard that right. Sewers. <sighs> I'm pretty sure that's a step down from just plain old swamp. <laughs> but at this point, if it keeps Sarah safe, how bad can it be? Either way, the radiation's through the roof. So Lucy managed to get her hands on some crazy prototype hazmat suit for me. And I get a snazzy ID card now to get inside. So here's hoping I don't lose it. Nice. So that explains the prototype hazmat suit we just found. Alright. Uh, yeah, there's no point of fast traveling seeing as we're pretty much already here at Dire Chemical. So the last time we were here, I think it was like... If not the last video... Oh no, it was like two videos ago or something like that. Uh, we ended up coming through here. <laughs> oh yeah. There goes that, uh, Siege Breaker Sentry bot. I just want to kill this guy. Oh, you want to fight? What the hell? What the hell just blew up? Alright, let's go. I'm not trying to blow up. Let's go! Screw you, Lieutenant! All right, but I remember, I remember this mission now. We have to go this way. I'm not gonna go and through it all and kill everybody. Order will be restored. Let's go. Sick. I wonder what's gonna happen to those ghouls or what ended up happening to those ghouls. Cause he said that that one guy. Oh, dude, there's a vault dweller here. I'll take the food though. But is he a vault seventy six vault dweller? That's what I want to know. Got a mini nuke there. I'm not interested though. Oh, hello. All 
All right, let's see. What? You know, I haven't even been hit with radiation yet. I have the prototype suit, but it's not really affecting me. Unless uh, my perks are resisting and wall. Which I'm not complaining. You, give me your food. Oh, look. Feral ghouls with clothes on. Sarah Samir. Lucy's holotape. Let's go ahead and listen to this. To anyone who will listen, my name is Lucy Harwick, and I'm here with many others just like me. We may look like those mindless things we call ghouls, but we're not. We're still people. Real people with the thoughts and feelings. And all those other things that make us all human. Lucy, they're here. Shit! Everyone grab a weapon. We're not going down without a fight. Oh my god. But if Duncan died, it sounds like Duncan died here after he killed Lucy. Where the hell's Duncan? I don't know. That's crazy, but we got a uh, suppressor's pyrolyzer. There we go. Alright, so reduces your target's damage output by 20 seconds, or 20% for 3 seconds. Um, not very useful for most characters out there, but you know what? It's pretty cool and unique. And it, well, I take it back. It really is unique, but I kind of want to look around here really quick. I don't want that. Exit. Where does this take me? How encumbered am I? Oh my God, dude. This pyrolyte, 30 pounds this thing weighs. But that's because, oops, that's because we got the Pyrolyzer and the Civil Unrest. Two weapons that we just got right now, so that's pretty crazy. But, I mean, I guess, I, let me, hold on, let me see. Is there anything else we could do quickly? No, I think in the next video we're going to go to the mayor's office, because that's over there in Watoga. Um... I mean, yeah, that's pretty much it. After that, we're pretty much done. And depending on how long that lasts, we'll probably do this one. And we're pretty much done before Wastelanders. But for now, we're going to call it a video. Do me a huge favor. Drop a like on the video and subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next video. Deuces.